Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to create a nav in React using Material UI. First of all, let's create a component. I want to call it my nav material UI.js. Okay. And then initialize your component function. Okay. Then go to your browser and search for install material UI and go to the site of MUI.com. And there's a default installation section. Uh, we need this command. So copy the NPM one. Well, uh, it's my preference and paste it inside your command line after you installed it successfully. Uh, let's go and add some imports. First of all, we need a app bar so we can actually wrap uh, every element inside our component uh, inside this app bar. So let me take this and put it here. Okay. And any other thing uh, should uh, come inside this app bar. And then we need a toolbar. Uh, both of them are imported from MUI slash material. Let's add a toolbar as well. Okay. And then uh, for the navbar brand, what we call navbar brand, we need a typography. Okay. Also imported from material UI. Add a tag of typography. And uh, here you can actually add an icon, a logo, or anything you like. I want to just add a text like my material UI navbar. And we can also add a variant. So we can actually say uh, how we like to uh, we like it to look like. I want it to be an H6 and the component, which is the HTML tag that we specify. I want it to be a div tag, simply. Okay, and also the SX feature, I want the flex grow to be one. Okay, so it uh, takes actually most of the nav bar. And then uh, I want to have a couple of links here. So I want to wrap them inside the stack. Also imported from the same library. Let's add a tag of stack. Okay, and inside this stack, uh, I want to have a couple of buttons. But uh, at first, so let me uh, set the direction of the stack to row. So they are in one row and spacing to two. Okay, and the last thing to import is button. The specific button of material UI. And I want to have a couple of buttons here for home, about, and contact. And the last step is to set the color of each one to inherit. And that's pretty much it. Go to your app.js and add a tag of your component. And let's go to our browser. As you can see, we have a nice navbar. That's all. Thanks for watching.